Okay, go back again. Here you lie here. In this little video, we're going to have a quick look at the mods and what to do, how to get them, etc. So in the browser, you guys are going to have to um, load up snowrunner.mod.io. I'll leave a link in the description. This is where I am at the moment. And when you get there, you're going to have to, uh, if you haven't already got one, to create an account and um, log into it. And um, when you get there, you're going to have to go to the main screen. So I think if we go to games here, um, visited, no. Okay, games. Not oh, Snowrunner's right here, so just choose the Snowrunner one and it'll bring you back to here. Okay, once you're logged in, you can see I'm, 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 I'm logged in up here. Um, you can just scroll through and pick a mod. So you can see this one here is green, so I'm, I've already clicked this one. So if you want to subscribe to a mod, um, I'll leave some links in the description below to ones that, that I like. Alright, so we'll go to this one here, and then we'll go up here. You see, I'm already subscribed to it. Please go to this J Boosted guy for a minute. He does some good mods. You see, I've subscribed to most of his. So what I'll do is I'll subscribe to this one here, the Tatarin. So you just go to that, and up here on the right-hand side, you just hit subscribe to install. Okay, now... Let's stop buzzing around at the top there. Um, now you can shrink down, get rid of this, whatever, and we'll go back into the game. So I'll see you there in a second. Okay, here we are. Back in the game. I just have to join two videos together to get this to, the, to get to here. <laughs> That's cool. Um, when you load up your game, I want you to go to Mod Browser. If you never signed in before, then you will get this this um, authentication up. So you'll have to sign in the email address that you just um, used to log into Mod.io with. Um, oops. And then have access to your email. So we're going to send this verification and I'm going to grab my mobile phone and change my browsers and then you should have an email which I've got one already and um, open that up and just type in the security code that um, The email I sent you, five digits usually, and then you can see we've logged in. Well, oh. and you go close. Now on here you will see all the all of the ones that I've subscribed to, and they're currently all downloaded. You may have to wait a few minutes. Because if they're not downloaded, they will circle up here. Here's a new one. We just downloaded. Um, as they're loading up, they'll circle up. And you'll see that green thing up on the screen that says all the mods are downloaded. You'll have to wait in this screen until they're all downloaded. Um, yeah, I've got some here that I've... I've just turn them on down here so you can click on them turn them on down the bottom here on down the bottom next page um, turn that one on and this one on and then here it tells you if they're installed or not if they're not installed then um, now to view just what you've ordered see up here in the top right hand corner uh, the top the top bar here 
um, you can sort by I I always put in uh, uh, subscribe mods only and that will only give me the ones that um, I've got installed Now I've only, I've tried out so far on a different profile, I've tried out the Azov and I've tried out the Fleet Star. So once they're all loaded up, you can um, go back. Um, I'm sure I've got my right game. Yep, this is the one I've been using just here. Load into your game. Now these are really handy that now some of these mod trucks are really good. I've been these these JBE ones are uh, are really quite handy. They're um, um pretty cool. Now what we're gonna have to do I think is go to the truck store first. We don't have very much money. Um so we're gonna have to sell off some of these. So I'm just gonna grab a hold of some of these and um sell them off. If you've got some as well. I'm going to sell off my normal Azov. I sell off my normal Fleet Star. I'll keep the, that one's really, I'll sell off the Brigadier. If you've got these in your in your garage, um, go ahead and sell them off for now. We'll just grab some money into our account. I think we'll keep. Get rid of that. I don't mind that touch or so, we'll keep that for now. Okay, now we're going to go back. We've got a few dollars now, so go to the truck store. And up here, as you scroll through your mods, you'll see that this one here has been declassified for the um, area slash uh, Russian only area to buy in. So that can be bought in any area now. Um, I've seen mod with a blue line on them. So there's the, there's the GMC. There's the Hummer. There's the Fleet Star, the Low Star, which is here. I haven't tried that one yet either. Um, the Pay Star and the Scout um, and the Kamaz and the Royal and the JBE Tatarin or Tatarin, however you want to pronounce it. Okay, that's probably all there is. So we're going to go and have a look at. Let's look at this one. We'll purchase one of these. Actually, we'll purchase one of those as well. We'll leave it in the garage for now. Actually, so we'll get... I don't know how much money you've got. Oops, purchase. back truck storage they're down here there's now a new little um, thingy so at the moment we've got all the vehicles we have if we turn this one here off now we've only got the mods showing which is quite handy okay we'll go this one first because hmm, nice wheels um, I really like this truck so we're going to go to deploy and um, customize And I might as well just use the biggest engine we can get. We'll sell that one off. Gearbox is now all available. So we'll just use his gearbox. 
Um, the suspension was issues erased. Tires. I'm going to go straight for this. I like these studded ones. They're for snow as well. Uh, winch. He's, he's actually put in an autonomous winch on this one, which is really good. It means if we fall over, we can, um, and don't have our engine turned on, we can rescue our, our vehicle. Spare wheel. I'll oh, just leave the same one. What's the difference? Oh, I've already got one anyway. Doesn't matter which one it is. Well, these all standard frame add ons. It's a refract large that I liked, which was good. I purchased a refract large. And I usually use this one as a saddle low with a, a crane. And front bumper. I think we'll just use that for one. Miscellaneous. Oh, now see, it's taken off the roof rack. So you need to be careful what you buy here. Parking lights, I don't know where they are. Oh, these are there. So it keeps the horns. Oh, what's on bumper? Oh, shall I keep the oh, I don't that's a little light there. Exhaust is taken away the What's that one there? Dual exhaust dump. Oh, it's always the standard one there. And the rims, I think I liked all those ones. Lots of different colours go off to the bottom. Put all your various colours. And I'll just do my regular wing mechanic, apply sticker, uh, next slot, wing mechanic, apply sticker. And there we have it. This one also has rear steering on it, which is really cool. So we go back, just check what time it is. It's in the morning, so that's all right. In the garage. Um, a lot of these trucks are. Uh, watch the rear steering. Oh, actually, it's dual wheel steering. We can just see it turning there to give us a bit more of a excellent job. This is a great truck. I use it for tons and logs in the profile. Um, and a lot of these just make it life a whole lot easier. Um, this one steers really well, and um, one of my favourite trucks so far. So we'll just recover this back for now and. Retain that truck storage. We'll have let's have a look at one of these. Let's look at the uh, you know, mod trucks only. There you go. Let's look at the GMC uh, deploy customize. What sort of what is done here? So I've got the big engine purchase so Gearbox, he's got his JV special one, so we'll install that one. Suspension raised one, two. 
We got the tallest one, which is that one. Tires. That's what we're doing. I'll send the chest ones with chains on them. And the long ones, because I do. What's that one there? Nice three chains. There's quasi. Okay, they're the quasis. With. Yeah, we'll buy, we'll buy those. They got spots on them. Winch. Purchase. Diff lock. Oh, we haven't, that. We haven't actually bought that yet, and it's not available here yet. for this one yet. It's obviously using the, the standard one. My kit, the pen module, sideboard, all that sort of little trucks. Oh, it's a one slot. It's not available yet. See the weight come down there? Okay, well. Got a normal bed for this one. Looks pretty mean. Front bumper. Not red. Front bumper. So it's taking bumps off most of the vehicles. Toe loops. So I like that one. I'll have that one. Search light. Have double search lights. I don't mind a flat pick cap. Let's see what. Single flap cap. Where's that two flap? There you go. So we'll just get the flap cap and the rims. I've got one choice anyway. Colour wise, we'll just choose a. That one will do. It. And um look at this one as well. Once we're done. Oh the diff lock's always engaged, that's why. There's a diff lock there but it's always on. There you go. That's great. That's why I don't have a choice. So this thing will probably just get that anyway. I like some of these older trucks rather than some of the modern stuff that's available in the mods. Let's take it over here and have a... We haven't been out here before, so we'll have a little bit of mud. Get a little bit of the hydro. Or high-low, I should say. Get a little bit of a little bit of Good. 
So, you might have to bet your game a whole lot more fun. Especially if, um, you know, we're running on level. Whoa, it's going to fall over. Okay, so we'll just fall over. Let's see if we can use our autonomous winch now, because we have an autonomous winch. Once they're on there, and use the F key. Beautiful. So, do buy an autonomous winch. That's exactly what it's for. So, if you find the game too hard, or some of the trucks you've got, these are, uh, these come all unlocked already. All the features, you don't have to go and find them. All the add-ons for them, they come with all the add-ons opened. So, um, if you have any questions, just um, post them below. Um, I said, just go to mod.io, um, sign up, log into it with the game. Um, any time you go to mod.io and press that subscribe button, the next time you load up the game, go back to the mods folder. Let the mod load in and load up. Look for the little squirrely, circly bars. And, um... Uh, let the mod install. And when it's installed... Um... Go ahead and, um and go into the game so hopefully you've got enough money and uh, take it from there so i hope that helps um we'll catch you next time cheers for now